Hello there people, this is Bruce McCall, all Nintendo Bruce here, and we are back again on Dead Space, going on to our secondary objective. Uh, I did change around the force uh, explosive gun, I, I, I haven't come up with a name for, with, for it yet. Um, the weird thing is though, I've got a lesser clip, like, considering I had three shots before, um, on my grenade launcher, I, I now only have two, no matter how many clip things I put into it, so I'm not quite sure what's going on there, but hey, as long as I get some stasis on my force gun, then that would definitely remedy that. Okay, snowsuit, no longer having to run around like a, a madman, oh there we go, hopefully our secondary objective is still selected, which I might have to check in a second. Come on, you can make it through the wind. Cool. Right, just before advancing, though, whoops, wrong one. Let's just make sure it is. Uh, whoops. No, we want this one, which I thought I pressed before. Did, did I not press that in the last episode? I'm kind of sure I did, but I guess not. Well, as long as it's not too out of the way. Not back in there, please. No, it is actually a different place. Cool. Oh, and the force gun has got stasis to it. Right. I don't want to waste explosives on just one enemy. Little river gun. I'm not changing that gun for the world. I mean, you know, the iconic gun, the iconic gun from Dead Space 1 and 2, plus a rivet gun. Oh look, took his head clean off, fantastic. Don't get me wrong, I still love my creation, but, but my other creation anyway, but it, that rivet gun, absolutely love it, just makes things pop. Okay, stop being so happy, Bruce. You've got to actually uh, concentrate. I thought it was here, it said. Oh, okay. So I thought I heard things for a second there. In there, right. So we're backtracking a little bit. That's fine with me, because we might have missed some items. We might not have. We'll see. Oh, and that generated. That's cool. Sure to have your ration card stamped after every meal. We don't want anyone going hungry. Yes, you've mentioned about hunger, and you're making me hungry. Stop it. Okay. Over here. This shouldn't be too much. Hmm. This shouldn't be too much backtracking. I think I loosely remember this. Yeah, we couldn't get in here before, could we? And I remember I was freezing my uh, backside off. Obviously not literally. Um, but yeah, I had to rush this little bit last time. <coughs> mm. Okay. Nice and homely. Optional mission supply depot. Oh, look at this. So, let's go over here. <laughs> uh, we don't need a suit coisk. Let's go over here. Be completely different. I might be making things longer for myself, but we'll see what happens. You guys know how it is. The path tells you to go one way, you go the other, and you usually end up getting rewarded, so... We'll see. As long as the reward isn't death. It's a rather long elevator. Just notice that is a vent up there. Christ, how long does this go on for? Oh, 
Oh. Very, very silent. And very, very dark as well. Oh! Electrocution module. Okay. I might or might not have one of those. Huh. I don't think I'm supposed to be here. Nope, I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to be anywhere near here. Yeah, we don't want to be away from our current location, so... Okay, fine. It was a, a kind of waste of time. This is obviously going to be integral in the future, I'd imagine. down the extremely long elevator. It'd be interesting to see if that was just trouble loading and that this just opens up straight away now. At least I hope that's the case. <coughs> hmm. Is there, is there actually any movement there? Well, you can see the lights going off, but... If that's actually part of the elevator, perhaps I'm thinking too deep into that. I'm thinking if that's actually the ceiling up beyond the vent, then it's kind of a poorly designed elevator, really, in terms of game mechanics. Ooh, look at that ruffle on the uh, on the collar there. Gotta love a bit of ruffle. Back to the mission, anyway. I already acquired it, but okay. Oh, you're a slow thing. Okay. Oh. Gone. Gone bit of stasis. Oh. oh, you're still getting up. Okay, you can have a rivet. So I know, when I go low on ammo, I can just easily use the rivet gun all day um, until I run out of ammo. Okay, what's this here? Nothing else around. Got to keep an eye on that wobble bob sound as well. Oh, there we go. Good show, good show. How about that? Okay. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Grab me some tungsten, baby. Hmm. Here's some cracking, but... I think that's more the snow and the ice than the... than enemies out to get me. Ooh, look at this. How is ammo looking? Ammo still looking fresh. Why did I call ammo fresh? That makes no sense. It's fine. Show me what you've got. Oh, and... Poof. Right in front of me. No bother. Rivet. Oh, there he goes. Okay, back to over here. And I think we're definitely going to lay an explosive or two for you. It's fine, it's fine. Lovely. Absolutely love this game now. Well, I, I liked the game anyway, but... um. The fact that I've got two guns that I can confidently use at the wreck of art is amazing. Wreck of art. That, that's again some more poor English there. More like wrecking the enemies. 
Okay. There's a vent there. That looks not so promising. Okay. It's just there for kicks, I guess. Hmm. Let's not go in there yet. Aha! More supplies. Good show. What's that over there? Is that an enemy? It looks like a man in something. Ah. What is that? It's like a makeshift crucifix, but circle fix, maybe. Uh Alright. There's something wrong with this planet. Something very, very wrong. Make us whole. Huh. What do you suppose that means? Sergeant, please, sir, can we just get the hell out of here? No, not just yet. The transponder's further in. Sir! Wait for me! Oh, you don't. Damn it, you still got me. Okay, let's just wait for a few things. Let's have a, a cheeky little bit of a reload there. It's fine, you don't need anything. It's just beautiful, it really is. No, no, no. Oh, I hear the... I hear the other things. Oh, whoa! How do you escape that? Oh, not too close to the stuff. Yeah, I hear the slurpy things which I despise and I'm so glad I've got stasis on this gun. At least I thought I heard the slurpy things. Last corpse. Wonder what that's about, eh? this gun. I absolutely love it. I'm in love again, people. I really am. Okay. I think that's the last of that lot. And am I still looking good on ammo? Somehow, yes. I don't get how, considering I'm using explosives and it's two for a clip, I think, or something. In fact, what does it say there? So it says I've got 33. Yeah, so 33 grenades and then that's it. But you know what, they get the job done so, so well. More action out of events. Okay, maybe not. Wasn't sure whether I heard a wobble bub then. Okay, I guess down here we go. I thought I honestly thought I heard those crawly enemies earlier on, by the way, but you know that enemies I absolutely hate. For those of you that have followed me through Dead Space 1 and 2, I absolutely despise those super fast crawling enemies. No. Alright, let's jump back over here. It's fine. <laughs> oh, he's got no head. That's also fine. Jewel headless. Oh no! Oh no! That's my bad there. Totally forgot I only had two grenades. Oh, you know what? You, you can have the rivet. Oh, you still got it. God damn it. Don't think you can dodge the rivet. What did I punch there? I didn't even see. No, you don't. You've got... How? No, 
Okay. Is that the last of it now? <laughs> All these items. you got to love it. I swear I didn't pick up one of those things. Doesn't matter. See, all of that, and I still have 32 that I can use, 32 grenades. So I'm obviously doing something right with this weapon. I, th I think I have found the ultimate weapon, guys. I really have. I mean, honestly, slow for the state. Uh, slow with the force gun. Line them up. You can even change weapons. You know, it's oh, oh, it's just beautiful. Okay, what's over here? Nope. I should have just used that. In fact, I can even stand on you, can't I? Because I'm pretty sure there's a standing achievement as always. Repeater? Oh, hello. Okay. Anyway, what's I saying? I'm pretty sure there's an achievement in all the Dead Space games where you've got to stand on a certain amount of enemies. Um... Speaking of achievements, uh, just before the be whoa, just before the beginning of this episode, I believe it was, I um, I got a create a blueprint achievement. You know, just because I wanted to save that explosive gun before changing it around and accidentally forgetting what I did with it. All right, come back to you. I doubt it was a secret achievement. <clears throat> Very bland, but I don't care. I've got explosives up there, eh? It's all very silent. Ah, you wouldn't be so easy as just going in an elevator. Anytime, there we go. Lovely. Alright, yep, don't stand underneath it. Ah, uh, I knew it wouldn't have been easy as just one. Have that, thank you. Lovely. You can have the rivet. Oh. No. Alright, come at me, come at me, come at me, come at me. Oh boy. Well, at least this gives you time to reload. I thought those were my body pieces then. And I should have remembered, should have remembered. Explosives at close proximity, not great. Scavenger bot waiting at bench, cool. Alright then. Let's just go on up and see what happens. And I might have to end it soon. We'll see if we can find ourselves a, a cheeky little bench before that. Um, doesn't look like we will though. Oh! Bench, perfect. Okay, grab all these goodies. That's that. Let's see what little bots have found, eh? Okay, so we've got repeater, electrocution module, a scavenger bot. Over 100 tungsten we've got now. Cool. What is the... Is that ration seals? I can't even read that from here. Not quite sure what they're for. Okay, let's sell off a few bits. Oh, we'll even shift a uh, little med pack or two now. Now that we've got the ultimate combination of weapons. Oh, look, still four lots of clips. That's fantastic. Uh, oh yeah, sell them. Okay, right. Let me know your thoughts, guys. Have I got the ultimate weapon combination? You know, I'm sure, obviously there's hundreds of combinations, and I know there's going to be some really decent ones. But come on, like I said earlier, on one hand, slow people down, 
line up your explosive and go from there. Or what's that? Slow them down and go to a plasma cutter slash rivet gun with electrocution properties? Amazing! Absolutely amazing! So, let us know your thoughts. And until next time, you guys take care, and I will see you again soon.